Hello, I'm John Prox, I'm from John of the West. I'm having a Wolf Among Us adventure. And I'm, I've got 45 minutes left, apparently. Um, don't know what that means. He's <laughs> asleep, you fucking idiot. Right, hey! let's kick him open. Ow. Wasn't expecting that to, uh... <laughs> Hey, look, Woody, it's the sheriff. I thought something bad was going on. Okay, okay, before you get all huffy, it, it was Snow who let me go, all right? It just, That's there was fine. no sense in me staying in jail. She, she said so herself. Don't spoil right. yourself, Woody. I'm sure he understands. And if he doesn't, he can take it up with the missus later. Luckily for you, I don't have the time to get pissed off about this right now. Well, Alright, yeah. On wanna in. Stay Come chill! Alright, I was worried that Holly was going to be what? here. He's a traveler. A weary traveler in Why is Gren being so nice to me? Right? Just what in the fuck is wrong with you? Nothing's wrong with me. In fact, I'm in a good goddamn mood. So you should take advantage. See, hi. Um, yes, hello. Uh, sorry, it's, uh, had conversations to have I drink. Be before Anybody I properly started talking. Friend, Swinehart said you shouldn't mix you it. You think I give a fuck what that fucking guy says? Oh, he's on medication. Say? See, Woodsman's seem kind of nice Friend, now. Really, you shouldn't drink right now. I can't hear you when you mumble. You should quit while you're ahead with that stuff. I might need your help. Holly's asleep in the back. Won't be able to wake her. Really? It's probably for the best. The doc gave him both barmesidal ambrosia for the pain. Look, the deal is, if you resist going to sleep like I am right now, it gives you a very, very, very nice high. Fair enough. He was high. And he said that he shouldn't mix it with alcohol. All right, is he going to turn into a dangerous monster? Yes, he did. I mean, Certainly. I know he's already a dangerous monster. Let me tell you something. I haven't felt this good in a long time, fat boy. Have you seen her sister's things? What wasn't burned at the funeral? I saw her come in with something, but I didn't see where she put it. Nope, haven't seen it. Fair enough. That funeral Good. back there? That was a shitty fucking send-off for a pretty okay lady. Yeah. You weren't fucking there. I'm talking to Bigby now, okay? <laughs> he would have been there. I'm sure he was in prison because of me. I helped things much. Ren, don't start nothing. Who's starting anything? I'm not. You need quiet. Hold him a tongue. It's all right. I'm too out of it to get into it. I want to clear the air. We're all in this dung heap of a fucking shit town together. We're all gonna have a toast. All of us. Ellis? This is the Grendel. One thing. To look through Lily's belongings and get out of here. Now, yeah, right? yeah, I know, I know. And I want to help you, okay? And I will. But first, indulge me. I say indulge him. He's on show medication. Of good faith. And after, we'll all hunt and peck for Lily's shit or whatever. Grand Bigby didn't come here to get loaded with you. I don't want to get loaded with him. Let's drink. I'm just having one. I'm sure it will impair me later on, but... You know, dead. he's in pain. He's in literal pain. But, you know, he lost a friend. I can try and be nice. Alright, now help me. What a free drink. Oh, God. Uh, he shouldn't Ren, drink with that. Doc said you needed to rest. How many times you fucking gonna warn me about it, huh? Oh You're not dear. my fucking <laughs> oh mother, God. So just get off my back. I said I was sorry, all right? I can't do anything about it. It's done. Oh. Let's separate them. Come on. What more do you want? What else can I fucking say here? What is the problem here? What stupid shit will you both not let go of? Oh, I forgot. 
You haven't heard the news. This walking oh. lard cake was paying Holly's sister to let him fuck her behind all of our backs. Oh yes, Holly no, I did know that. Find out going through all of her sister's shit. What fun that must have been. Trick after trick of this fat ass and Lily. I didn't plan all right. that, all right? And our thing, whatever it was, it wasn't a big deal. <laughs> it wasn't. This I never doesn't seem like she was snowing. I didn't know nothing about that. No, but you knew. This seems like none of my business. Out, and you knew for a damn good fucking reason. You know what? Fuck this. I don't need this shit. Oh yeah, that's it. Now you're teary-eyed. You were always such a low life. I don't know why I never realized it till now. What do you think about this fucking loser, Sheriff? He can do oh, whatever he size. wants. I don't give a shit. No, that's okay, because I'll tell you what he thinks. Wait, wait. I've got some questions for you. What possible questions could you have for this beast? I'm trying to change the subject. Everything's a problem when I want to talk, but when the woodsman's about to leave, it's, oh, wait, I have questions. What do you want? When you saw Lily, I'm trying to do an investigation. Did you ever mention anything about a witch? No. We didn't talk about work. All right. All right, well, I've tried to change the subject, diffuse the situation. It's kind of hard, because it's all going to be about Holly. I don't know where Lily's shit is. Check Holly's room, I don't know. But I wouldn't wake her if I were you. Sleepwalkers and trolls. I think that's the role. Maybe uh, ogres, too. I thought you said you would help me look. Actually, I maybe why I if you excuse me, it seems that I'm going to pass out. What a day. Am I right, Sheriff? What a fucking day. Ah, <sighs> poor guy. Grin won't remember this. <laughs> That's brilliant. I'm impressed. I love that. That's um, very amusing. It means nothing. I get it. But... That's, uh... Holly. No, don't wake her up. Uh, let's look at the alcohol. Try not to wake her up. Um, hmm. I've got money on me now. What about this cot? Ah, there we go. Shh. I've been warned not to wake her up, but I don't know if I want to steal stuff. Oh, it's a bottle of that stuff. There's three of them. Is that a faith? closed and Lily ain't around anyway so you can run off back to the woods I guess I know it's dishonest but I didn't want to trouble her let's take a bottle did you care about her at all she was a nice girl ran around too much I'm just gonna try and be nice I still care. I hope so. I hope you do. I don't want to stay for too long. Oh, look, there's one of the uh, Tweedles in the background. Maybe that's a clue. Look at the back! Look at the back! Look at the back of the photograph, you idiot! I don't know why you fucking came here. There's nothing left for you to ruin. And I'm not in an entertaining mood. I'm sorry, Holly. I'm sorry for what happened. I'll make it up to you. Ah, uh, sure you will, kid. When the rivers turn coarse and the sky bleeds fucking gypsies. 
I'm guessing she won't remember this either. Um, there's the glamour tube. I didn't see all that stuff before. A dress book. And I know there's the troll symbol as well. I think there's a troll symbol. My recording, I am good. Uh, oh, Lily's hang on. P funeral. It was just so fucked tonight. But I, don't know I really still again. wish you could have been there. I just don't know what Bigby's doing. If he, if he cares about it. If he even gives a shit. I don't know. I don't know why he showed up. I just wish he'd get out of my fucking life. I'm gonna stay quiet. I'm not gonna advocate on my, for know, myself on behalf of other people. Okay. That's dishonest. I get it, everyone hates me. <laughs> if you were getting your glamour on this day, then one of these has to be the witch. Uh, oh, uh, AG, yeah. I hope he remembers. Hello, this is Snow White calling. I'm looking for Bigby. Is anyone there? Bigby, right. Pick up, okay? I never turned to drink, it seemed to turn to me, Snow. Benjamin Franklin. Oh, thank God. Tell me you found something. I got it, Snow. Her address was here with Lily's things. It's on, uh, White Plains Avenue, 1284. It's an apartment complex. Great. You're welcome. <sighs> Thanks. Listen, we have to hurry. Look, I was nice. All right, I'll see you there. What time are we on? Uh, I can't tell. Twelve minutes. Okay. Cool. Huff and puff. Like the cigarettes. Big B. I just got here. Yeah, me too. It's number twenty-three. I haven't seen it yet. We're late. Yeah, I know. Ah, oh, I didn't know we were late. This is it. All right. How do you want to do this? Aha. Uh hmm, -huh. kick. It's gonna work one day. Wait, 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 wait. What are you doing? What does it look like? Don't just kick it in. We don't know what's on the other side. Let's just save the gonna last kick. resort for last. Makes sense? Fine, okay. What would you have me do instead? I don't know. Knock? I mean, we have no idea what's behind this. Hello? Alright, well, that was somewhat unexpected. Hi. You woke me up. Hi. Uh, sorry about that. Well, pardon the intrusion. I wasn't aware this was a munchkin's house. Well, Dorothy, it isn't. <laughs> Sharp kid. <laughs> Dorothy's a girl's name. If I was any less secure in my manhood, I might take it as an insult. What's your name? She Rachel? will remember that. What's yours? Just so... I'm Big B. This is Snow. <laughs> I'm not going to call myself the Big Bad Wolf. Nice to meet you. How do you do? Is there, um, is there anything you need? Is Auntie Greenleaf at home? Does she live here? You mean my mom? She ever, you know, make the nightstand levitate, turn frogs into cats, that kind of thing? Is she a witch, dear? Oh, no, I would never call my mommy that. She treats me all right. <laughs> is there something you want? Snow, can you just do something here? I, I never have any idea what to say to these people. You mean children? <laughs> children. <sighs> do you mind if my friend here takes a look around? I promise we'll be quick so you can hurry back to bed. Don't break into her house. She didn't answer the question. I've been here all night. Nobody's been here. I didn't imply anyone had. Okay, Snow, I'm gonna trust your friend not to break anything. Don't get me in trouble. Look for anything on the Sounds YouTube. like Yeah, like Cranes. He could still be here. It was in the Powerpuff Girl bubbles. It's in that woman who's in everything. Let me guess. All right, let's have a look around. Classical. Honky tonk. No. Counting for taste. Indeed. 
that your mom? Uh-huh. Doesn't ring a bell, but then again, mom a hunter. Be oh no, she never that was found in the woods around Dick's Mountain, I think. It's pretty rare to see a burner like this. <sighs> Dowdy. That's how we like it. Uh, witches like burners, don't they? They love shoving children in there. Boy, if I remember Hans and Gretel. Um... Oh, hang on. That reminds me. I've got more fables, don't I? Yes. Uh, one for the chip trap. I mentioned it because I didn't realise... I, I didn't realise that that's Hans and Gretel, clever hands. Um, Should have been more obvious to me, but it wasn't. Chip trap. The oldest bar in New York City, the Chip Trap, was established in 1725 in a secret by Starkad, the legendary Viking and reprobate, as a place for fables to meet and drink and commiserate. Known then as the uh, Grammar Grammarian's Tavern, he eventually lost it to a bet, to, uh, lost it in a bet to a tribe of mountain trolls who quickly renamed it, made it their own. Holly is the current proprietor, I mean, having inherited it from her mother when she died in the boating accident in the early 20th century. There we go. And again, we managed to miss one right there. Uh, am I missing anything? Oh, well, I am late, which is annoying. Been over all night, so He's just going to... What is this? Mommy uses that it's to carve tree. trinkets. It's from the old world. Trinkets? Ooh. Um, like glamours? Not here. There's no one here but me. That's bad parenting. Apparently. I know, I'm not a parent. Where um, do you buy your clothes? At a store? Oh. My mommy makes all of mine. Ooh. There's a partition. Ooh, are you hiding something? I like the wall moves. Nothing that looks like Crane was here either. Nothing. The wall moves. The wall. Go back. There's a wall. All right. Maybe not. Maybe I was. How much longer do you think it'll be? Not much longer. Gonna click on. Gonna click on everything. Deliver to Auntie Greenleaf, the butcher. butcher. What's that? A package. It's not a baker or butcher. a um, candlestick maker. It's empty. I should ask my pig friend about him. Nothing. Keep getting whiffs of that aftershave of his. I do too. Um, glamour. Now, please. Is that a glamour tube? Mommy really doesn't let anyone play with that. Trust me, I tried. Well, that's really, really suspicious. Do you think the little girl could be crane? Please just put that back exactly where you found it. No one is allowed to play with it's that. It's all right, honey. Bigby's not going to break no, it. I don't understand. She will freak out if she discovers I've let people in here and let them touch her stuff, okay? She checks all the time to see if things move. I don't want to get in trouble. Look, I have to check this out. I'm sorry. No! Put it down! Please, don't! This isn't what you think! You gotta believe me! The guy isn't here, I promise! It's gonna be okay, Rachel. Please, I'm begging you. I don't wanna... I don't wanna get in trouble. Oh, I, I feel really mean, but it's good. <laughs> Well, at least it wasn't Crane. When you do it that fast. Sorry. What? Why Rachel? Why the little girl? I don't think that's any of your business, Wolf. Why? How about because it works? That's why. I'm good enough for that's you. That's a good enough reason. Even worked on you. Didn't know you had a soft spot for children. All right. Start explaining. And from the beginning. Where's Crane? Speak quick. Where are the drugs? I have, teller, Wolf. I have no heavenly idea where he went to. You're you a witch. Something, unless you want a recipe for owl stew. 
There's nothing I know that would help. Just why in the name of everything holy are you protecting this weaselly scumbag? I mean, what on earth could he have done to deserve this kind of loyalty? Crane could be hollow bones tomorrow, and you wouldn't see me cry a drop. Hmm. But that doesn't time we on. tell you anything. You have friends, don't you? Well, I don't want Crane's friends for enemies. If you're not protecting Crane, who are you protecting? Get this through both of your skulls. I can't tell you. Just you be it. Doesn't sound that old. Enough. There's powers at work here beyond your pathetic authority. I don't believe you. Whatever it is that's keeping you from saying something, you have to forget it. We can protect you, okay? Whatever it is you're afraid of, we can make sure that it won't come to pass. Do you I don't think we can, but I didn't want to be aggressive. You. Okay, you know what I think? I think we've been more than patient with you. This witch has been selling illegal glamours that continue to undermine everything we've built. She's harboring a fugitive that took advantage of it, and now she's resisting every attempt to make things right. I frankly don't give a crap if she's afraid for her life. We can at least make sure she never hurts us again. We're destroying the tree. No! How dare you come in here and threaten to take from me the one thing that... That tree is ancient. It's part of the family, and it's the only thing paying for this shithole apartment. And the fables who can't afford the glamours from you come to me for help. Without them, where do you think they could go? Don't give me that. You're making money off of other people's misery. Two fables are dead because of this crap. It's too dangerous leaving this stuff with her. You think I like being the old woman in these stories? The men uh -huh. are heroes, the ladies are whores, and the old hags like me get to watch everyone they love die. We have very different ways of handling our fate. And very different means to handle it, too. Isn't there another way? She's a witch. Can't she just work for us that way she'd be efficient Trying to be nice you want to reward her for criminal behavior we can't trust this woman on the 13th floor. it doesn't matter because i'd never do it i'm not a house cat and i don't play well with others oh, trust me no one would confuse you for a cuddly animal we did earlier Bigby, like well this is you know what i mean burn the tree no look, look oh. I'll, tell you, I'll tell you crane was here he was here and he left he went to the pudding and pie to try to use my ring on the girls over there to get information. What does the ring do? He thinks it's the ring of dispel. You know, that it will pierce the protection around the girls' speech. He says pulling the truth out of them will prove his innocence. Ah, there we go. The damn thing lost its power decades ago. I'm sorry, but we still can't let you keep the tree. It wouldn't be right after what's happened. Big B. Please, Sheriff. Today is your lucky day, Greenleaf. I'm hiring you as the business office's newest witch in residence. I'm trying to come up with a happy medium. I know, Snow's annoyed. Trouble. And we have a glamour shortage as it is. It makes the most sense now. She'll get over it. I don't want to ruin one person's life. Especially if I can make the, the, the town better, right? Just don't expect me to bow down to your little woman here. She, um, it's a bit off-putting because the voice actress doesn't sound old enough. So it needed. I know I'm being here, petty. Something like that. We'll call you. But yeah, it just sounds like a person pretending to be an old lady. Go, I mean, it's just a bit weird. She, I, she doesn't look old enough or or sound old enough. Anyway, what time we are? We must be near the end, right? I have been uh, a severe case of lycanthropy. Um, I've been John Proxon to John the West. Bloody hell, the car just went through me. Uh, I've been having a, uh, a Wolf Among Us adventure, and I will see you guys next time.